Hello, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. I'm King Posh. Of course, you all know that. So, last thing on our on our list of the play seat car pack is the 2016 Vauxhall Corsa VXR. So here it is. Now, of course, I already have a tune for it, but I figured I'd show you it's twenty-eight thousand dollars. Fair enough. All right, and you can go for an array of colors on this thing, and they all look really nice, especially the green and the red. We'll go with red. Or it's 56 tokens if you paid for tokens, but I don't know why you would. It's so easy to make money in this game. Especially to buy a, t a car at this price. Look how gorgeous she is in red. Voxel. Such a gorgeous car. Let's look at the engine here. Mm-hmm. Oh, four banger. 202 horsepower. Yep. Pretty nice. It's funny. It's got more horsepower than the, uh, the, uh, the turbo uh, V6. Um, Renault Alpine that we just got done with and it's uploading now so I don't know what's coming up first either that or the Honda S800 so let's give this you know what we need a new horn and yes I have everything that works perfect for this guy alright Alright, let's start this bad boy up. Is it going to let me start it? That's mean. Yeah, can we... Alright. Alright, maybe it just doesn't want me to rev it up. Well, we'll rev it up eventually. Because we're going to take it out right now. Um, we're going to see what it does on the road. Oh yeah, look at this. Look at those flames. Alright, so it's front wheel drive, of course. It says it goes 150 on the... No, 160. 160 on the speedo. Oh no, wait. I just wanted the... No, wrong button. Always issues here. There. That's pretty good for a hatch. That's what you call this a hot hatch? Fifth gear. Hey, it handles pretty well. I wouldn't think this thing can drift, though. Hey, for stock, not bad. you guys think that I should make a front-wheel drive drift tune for this this car right here please 
put it in the comments below. It really isn't that bad. I, I'd keep the original engine too. I, it works pretty well. I could never make this jump because there's always cars here. It's coming up. And look at that. It's finally clear for me. Woohoo! Five hundred and twenty feet. Hey, oh no, I didn't get anything out of it. Wait, I can go across here. All right, let's get right into the tunes and show you what I did to this car. Alright, let's see how much it costs to upgrade the car. Alright, so I went from 202 horsepower to 719 horsepower. Big boost. Yes. So, let's go look at it. Nine downloads, alright, sweet. Alright, so they've been trying it. 61,000 credits to uh, obtain this tune. So 61,000 is not that bad. So if you want a cheap, you know, all-wheel drive drift car, and a lot of people have been asking me, Posh, I need a cheap tune. Here it is. Here's a cheap tune. So, of course, we'll just show you guys the simple stuff here. All right, so I went with the 2.0 liter uh, inline four, just like the Honda S800. Uh, um, you can get a turbo rally in there. Or you can just go with the stock, which is 202 and upgrade it and see what you can get. Or you can take the turbo rally and upgrade it and see what you can get. I went with the 2.0 liter. Getting that, that full power out of there. All right. And of course, I made it all-wheel drive. And you can make it real-wheel drive if you like. Uh, I made a, a single turbo. You can have centrifugal force supercharger if you like, uh, depending on what you're doing. Um, if you're doing rear wheel drive or front wheel drive drifting, I'd highly recommend using this one right here. So, all right. And everything else is pretty explanatory here. So, let's get out of that. There's no body kits for the car. Sadly, I wish they would have had some body kits for it, but they don't. So, no window there. Um, what we did here was we went with stock tires, stock front, and stock rear. Yep. And everything here is race in there. Um, did we put race in here? No, we did not this time. So, no front um, anti-roll bars and no rear anti-roll bars. Big things I like to check what I've done. Alright, so in light as possible and no roll cage because it doesn't look that bad in there. And it increases some of the stuff, like the braking, but that's about it. So, it's all up to you guys on what you want to do. Um, race springs, look at that. Boom, 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 boom. Look at this, look at those back tires. They're freaking out. They're like turning. Left and right, left and right, left and right. Alright, anyways. I've had enough fun. And race brakes. All right, let's go right into the tune. Let's show you what I did. All right, so we got 55, 55, and I'm gonna be quiet from here on out until we hit the end.
And there you have it. A little different. I put it to 99.99 instead of 97.97. I want to open up a little bit more on this one. It's because it's just a smaller car, and I, I put more more power to the to the rear for this thing. So let's go drive it and see if it handles any different from the last one. Not bad. Please be on his side. Alright. We're gonna go this way this time. Bam. New PB, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh man, one star. Oh man. Are you moving up? Oh man, burn that tide. Still very grippy. But what do you get for what do you what do you want from a cheap car? I mean, I mean absolutely so amazing. I mean the two forty could be pretty amazing, it's pretty cheap. I, I guess you could go with that. I want a straightaway. Alright, sweet, let's go. It does not drive straight. But as you can see, it ain't that bad. You just gotta, you know, work with the steering wheel just a little bit. Not too bad. Whew, whew. What a traffic there. Well, not too bad. Kind of like looking at the uh, map and where I want to go. Over here. And hit that tree? Yes. I'm glad I hit that tree. See, it stays together, I mean, it's a heavy car. I mean, that tree should have ripped off my rear end, but it didn't. Ah, oh, 52, not bad. There you have it. I guess we gotta take it up to my one, my one track up here. Let's just see what it does. Need to get up to speed. on its face just a little bit and now you just fix that is you can just uh, if, if you wanted to go a little quicker really all you gotta do is just touch up the uh, uh, the gearing um, I mean you can you can take it to anything uh, 350 could work you know and uh, everything else is set right
get up that those pesky hills. There's a 139 up the hill. So yeah, I mean, it's all up to what you guys really want to do. We'll keep that for now. There you go. Bah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see some more, please comment down below. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe if you like what you're seeing. If you really like this video a lot, please smash that like button at least once. Just so it turns blue to you. And anything else, yeah, just message me. Let me know what you think. Alright, you guys, thanks for watching. Have a good rest of your day, evening, morning, wherever you are. Peace out.